Hello friends, you must have heard about Medusa in the Greek stories, a single glance of whose turned people into stone. Have you heard about such a mysterious lake that turns the living animals and creatures into stone as they enter into it? Yes, you got it right. Today we are going to tell you about such a mysterious lake that turns anyone who touches its water into stone. Friends, the name of this lake that turns into two stone is Lake Natron, which is situated in northern Tanzania. Nick Brand, a photographer, was taken aback by the scene there when he reached near the bank of the Natron Lake of North Tanzania in 2010. In fact, many birds had turned into stones because of entering into the water of this lake. He noticed a number of bird statues at different places on the bank of the lake. These were the statues of real birds now dead. Compiling the photos of these animals converted into stones, Brand in his book Across the Ravage Land wrote that nobody knows for sure as to how these birds had died. But it seems that the excessively reflective nature of the lake must have confused them. That's why they fell into the water where excessive salt and soda content classified them to convert into stones in a short while. Brand told that salt and soda contents are in abundance in the water of this lake so much that it frees the ink of my Kodak film box in a few seconds. The temperature of the lake reaches up to 60 degrees. The alkaline level of the water is pH 9 to pH 10.9 which means that the alkaline level of the water is equal to ammonia level. The substance found in the ash of volcano was found in this water also. Let me tell you that this substance was used by the Egyptians to preserve mummies and maybe for the same reason, the remains of the birds were safe in the same gesture. Brian goes on to write that all the animal bodies had become rock strong because of calcification. So we could not change them anyway for the sake of a better photograph. So we put them on the trees and rocks in the same condition. This lake is of pink color when looked at from the sky. The reason is that varieties of some red and green algae are found in this lake. This algae can survive in this water and that's why this lake looks of pink color from the sky. Because of this specific body diversity, Tanzania in the year 2001 included this lake in the list of lakes of international importance. So friends, that's all in today's episode. If you liked this video, please press the like button and subscribe to the channel. This is your friend Neha Agarkar. See you in the next episode. Till then, goodbye.